Here we are at the MRI Imaging Center at the Texas A&M University College of Veterinary Medicine. Right now our calf is under general anesthesia and being monitored by our anesthesia service. Uh, we are uh, monitoring the animal's vitals, heart rate, respiration rate, blood gases and so on. Uh, the, the calf is uh, asleep in the, in the MRI, MRI imaging tube and we are doing a series of images to show the effect of the inappropriate injections, uh, how they affect the, the muscles and ultimately the meat products. The goal of the MRI is to give the producer another way to think about how those products, when they're placed in the muscle, how they ultimately affect the, the product, whether it's trim loss, uh, lesions that might show up that, are, that when the retail product hits the, the cooler case and, and uh, would, would ultimately affect consumer confidence. Here you can see the lesions in the muscle while the calf is still alive. Here's a good image of the left side of the calf's neck where we injected a clostridial vaccine in the muscle. This highlights the importance of following the labeled indications for a vaccine product such as the clostridial vaccine where the, the labeled indication was actually for a subcutaneous injection. We wanted to illustrate what happens when it's given inappropriately and here you can see very clearly uh, this white gray area here. This is all normal muscle around and that's damaged muscle there which would uh, again result in, in trim loss there uh, of retail product.